Hey everybody, we're up here at the uh, relocated sawmill swarm. The tra trap is way down there on the hill. Let's see if I can get it in here. It's right over on that tree. Let's see. Oh, there it is, right there. So I took them back to my yard, let them reorient, and put them here. Stuck a Ross round on top since they're so full of bees. Kind of cool today, so they started out slow. And uh, they're bringing in pollen. We had all yesterday to reorient. So, they're getting going here today. I gotta get something up here for those red carpenter ants. And uh, it should be good. Anyway, we're going to walk back down here and go to the uh, swarm trap that has another swarm in it. And he was saying there was a old abandoned farmhouse down the road that uh, was full of bees. And he's going to get a hold to his buddy to see if uh, he wants them out of there because they're selling the property. And I'd be more than happy to be with them and carry y'all along. But we'll walk back down here. Down here next to his garden. Oops, sorry about that. I didn't know how to zoom in. But anyway, that's probably a lot better. I mean, looking in my ear. But anyway, here we are, walking back. And this swarm trap here is on the edge of this this garden area but this whole field is open open as it can be to the uh to the road and all as you can see they're they're busy 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 i just wanted to show you guys kind of where where i caught them and how i caught them and where they're located at and there's another swarm trap over on the other side of the house over there and nothing's even around it so this got to be the ideal place for around here and uh, just like subscribe thanks for being with me talk to you later bye